If you have a prostate, benign prostatic hyperplasia, BPH, will most likely affect you at some point in your life. BPH is the most common prostate problem. It pretty much means that you have an enlarged prostate. When this happens, it could press up against the urethra and make it harder for pee or sperm to pass through. BPH usually occurs between the ages of 50 and 60. 90% of those with a prostate will experience symptoms of BPH by age 85. And half of this population will need treatment for those symptoms. The good news is it's non-cancerous and there are a variety of treatment options for it. If your symptoms are severe, your provider might suggest the following options. Finasteride, Proscar, and Dutasteride, Avidart. These two medications slow down the production of the hormone dihydrotestosterone, DHT, which causes the prostate to grow. They work well if you have a larger prostate. Drugs that relax the muscle in the prostate are a more common treatment. They work by reducing the tension on the urethra. Some of these medications include terazazin, hytrin, doxazosin, cardura, tamsulosin, Flomax, and alflazosin, uroxitrol. Going under the knife for BPH might seem pretty intense, but there are quite a few options, including minimally invasive ones, to treat this condition. Here are a few. With transurethral resection of the prostate, or TURP, a urologist will remove any tissue blocking the urethra with a small tube-like tool that uses an electric current to trim the tissue. While TURP takes about an hour, you'll have to stay in the hospital for one to two days. Recovery time can be between four and six weeks. The green light laser removes extra prostate tissue with, well, a laser. The advantage of this procedure, less bleeding during and after it's completed. Urolift uses tiny implants to pin back any tissue that's blocking your urine flow. This option can be done in a doctor's office under light sedation. Resume is minimally invasive and performed by going up through the urethra with an instrument that turns water into steam. The steam delivery lasts only seconds and helps to shrink the prostate. The tissue is destroyed and reabsorbed by the body within a three month period. This procedure can also be done in a doctor's office under light sedation. Holmium laser enucleation of the prostate, or HOLEP, is ideal for larger prostates. A laser is used to remove tissue that is blocking the urine flow. Another device is then used to remove any tissue that is left behind. HOLEP requires no incisions, and recovery time seems to be much faster than traditional surgery options. Treatment doesn't have to be overwhelming. Your doctor can walk you through the options for managing BPH and answer any questions you may have. And if you start to notice symptoms like stomach or genital pain while urinating, pain, fever, and or chills while urinating, blood in your urine, or not being able to pee at all, contact your doctor right away.